Hey, what's up? Chris Winter here for another DSLR video tip. Now, first off, I want to say a huge hello to all my new subscribers. Uh, I went from, I think, zero to 500 subscribers in about a day, so I'm really, really happy with that. Um, guys, I'm going to be trying to make as many videos for you, and I've got lots and lots of tips coming up, so stay tuned. Now, today, I want to give you a really quick tip, but it is an awesome tip, on how to keep your lenses safe when you're traveling and also for storing them. Now, this tip is also really cheap, which is really important because, you know, DSLR filmmakers don't always have that much money. So let's get to it. Okay, so this is my bag that I take out on location for uh, most days when I need to have pretty much everything that I need, but I don't want to be carrying absolutely everything. So it's a Case Logic bag, and I'll be doing a review on it because it is a fantastic bag, as you'll see when I open it up. But what I want to show you is what is inside. So you can see it's got these really cool compartments and it's all really well made. But uh, what I'm going to be showing you now is how I store my lenses. All right, so what I do is get these bags, which you can get off eBay for about, like I'm literally talking two to three dollars. And this is an absolute bargain because if you're going to buy these kind of lens pouches in a uh, store, uh, you're going to be paying, you know, upwards of twenty dollars at least. So what I've done here is simply got one of these lens pouches which I'll put a link in the description bar below and then put my lens in there. There's my Canon 18 to 135 STM lens, really cool lens, um, great for autofocus. The other thing that I do is I write the, uh, the, the specs of the lens on here so if you've got an assistant or uh, someone who doesn't really know about cameras that much they can quickly check the bottom or the side of this and then pull the lens out and then that's quite easy. So I've got a couple of these different lenses. I've got a 30mm. I've got two 30mm actually, the Sigma 1.4. It's a beautiful lens. I've also got a 50 and I've got the 18 um, and 135. Like I said, it's a really easy way to uh, protect your lenses um, from scratches. Look, it's not going to protect them from, from a drop, um, but if you've got a bag like this, it's not really going to be a problem. The way that I store them is I'll store them face down. Uh, so you're going to be having the prote protection from here and it's not going to be scratching up against this buckle right here. And then once I've done that, I'll also store them this way up so you can actually see the lens really quickly. So that is my tip of the day. Uh, I really hope you liked it. And like I said, it's a really good way of uh, storing your lenses if you've got a bag like this and it's better than what a lot of people do, which is put their lenses in socks. And I was a bit guilty of that in my earlier years. But yeah, guys, hope you liked it. All right, thanks. Okay, so that was my tip for how to keep your lenses really, really safe and also a cheap way of doing it because like I said, we don't always have a lot of cash coming in. So it's really important to be able to do this kind of thing really cheaply without, you know, getting ripped off. All right, guys, if you enjoyed this, I would really love it if you could subscribe. Like I said before, I, um, I'm going to be doing a lot more of these DSLR videos. I've got a whole wall full of things that I'm uh, going to be teaching you. So click the subscribe button. Also, click like if you liked it. And I will see you in the next video. See you guys. Bye.